Dealers have many KPIs to measure performance. However, with a limited budget, the question becomes finding the right vehicle on the lot that needs a boost to produce a sale. Dealerships today use many different types of KPIs to measure their digital advertising. One thing we find at Pure Cars is oftentimes the KPIs dealerships look at are vertical agnostic. In paid search, for example, they're looking at impressions, impression share, clicks, click-through rates, and all of these things are very valuable. But what dealerships oftentimes are missing is the fact of they have a finite ad budget. We have yet to see a dealer have an unlimited budget. So the key thing that needs to occur is what does the dealership want to market? Which VINs on the lot need a boost? Which VINs on the lot are poorly merchandised where the probability of getting that digital shopper to their showroom is less? You want to focus on the subset of vehicles that need a boost that are properly merchandised. Once you understand what to market, you then want to look at who you want to target. We think of this as researchers, browsers, and buyers. Since dealerships don't have an infinite ad budget, we want to attract buyers first. And then lastly, where do we want to attract these buyers? We see so many dealerships have geographic areas set as a round radius around them. I have yet to see a consumer with a shoestring attached to their dealership where they run in circles. It's critical to look at your geo by model since your higher end vehicles may be sold in a different market area than your lower end vehicles. You want to do this for new and used in every other department. If you think of your KPIs as what to market, who to market and where, then you're in a really good position to look at the vertical agnostic pieces which becomes bid optimization and other things.